This is the RSC-18, which is a brand new reciprocating saw that Festool just came out with. They've made it very easy to get your blades in and out using this clip-in system right here, where you can just push the blade in and it will clip in place. And then to take the blade out, you can just toggle that switch and the blade will pop out, which prevents you from burning your fingers on those times when your blade gets really hot. And then if you look right here, there's a green button, which when you push it, will allow you to move this fence up and down. On many saws, this fence right here stays exactly in the same spot the entire time, which means you wear out the blade mostly right in that area. But now by pushing this button, you can move this fence up into different spots to change the area where the blade is cutting to spots where the teeth haven't yet been worn out. On the top here, you'll notice that there's two different switches. This first one will change how fast the saw is cutting. And the second one is gonna change the way that the blade is cutting. In this setting, the blade will cut back and forth in a horizontal manner. And in this one, it's gonna do more of a pendulum cut for faster cuts, which is the same useful cutting options that they actually have on their jigsaws. Right back here is a green button that you can toggle back and forth to lock and unlock the saw. The saw is powered by an 18 volt battery, which runs a powerful brushless motor that also reduces vibration by up to 40%. Here on the side is a joist hook so you can hang the saw when you're not using it. And right here inside the case is something really neat. This is an attachment for dust extraction to help eliminate as much dust as possible when using a saw. And it easily just clips right here on the front. And to take it off, you can just pinch right here and pull it off. And Festool offers a whole range of blades that you can use with the RSC-18. This first big one here is for insulation and cardboard. These three right here that have the yellow tag on top are all the different shapes and sizes for wood. These two right here with the blue on top are for stainless steel and different metals. And this green one here is for a wide range of other building materials, like drywall or shingles or things like that. 